guys. So, this is my beetle. I've named her Stella Blue because when she's done, I hope to have her blue and white two tone. Uh, I think that'll look really good. It's the color my kid picked out. Uh, hopefully, it'll be his car someday. Uh, anyway, she's a 73. Um, when I bought her, I was told it was a Super Beetle, but it turns out it's just a standard Beetle, which is cool. Um, she didn't look like this when I got her. I'll put a picture in here somewhere of when I first got her. Um, I'm just trying to clean up some rust. Uh, we had a hole right here along the top of the wheel well. Pretty bad hole in the wheel well that looked like it had been patched up by Bondo pretty poorly actually um, typical 70s rust here from the foam up in here um, same on the other side we've got a pretty clean engine bay the shelves are a little bit bad but we're gonna fix those as well. The fenders are rough, to say the least. They have all these holes drilled in them for I don't know what, probably aftermarket signals that somebody put on. I'm gonna patch all those up and then fix some rust that's on them and bang out some dents you know 50 years worth of just driving around uh, this side of the car isn't too bad We've got some damage where the uh, floor pans are rusted out and the jack mounts um, gave way and then we've got this little bit here that I'm fixing. Um, this was all rusted out. Uh, the previous owner had tried to weld a patch in, but did a very bad job. Um, they they cut it really high. Uh, just mashed some sheet metal in there. So I had to kind of create my own patch to fill that in. This whole part is Bondo, again, um, pretty thick, you can see. Uh, from the inside, it looks like this was dented. I don't know how, maybe a hammer or something. It, was, it doesn't look like it was hit from the front. Just some dents in there. Uh, I don't have a light, so I can't really show you. Um, yeah, I mean, it's not in bad condition. Uh, I patched up some holes that were here from like license plate mounting and whatnot. Uh, I took the seal channel off here. Um, it was pretty rusted. I'm gonna replace that soon. I hope to get an adjustable front beam so I can lower it in the front. New shocks, adjustable shocks. Um, I'm going to be lowering it in the back, just changing the splines on the torsion bar. Um, new interior, of course, because this is pretty trashed. Um, doesn't even have a back like a back seat bottom. It has the the backrest, but not the bottom. So I gotta find one of those. Oh, gotta fix some rust here in the wheel well. Like I said, um, it's kind of come inside as well. And then we're just gonna do a whole full interior. New dashboard. Uh, new speedometer the one that was in here was ruined i have all the knobs and everything i'm gonna keep those 
Um, don't think I'll be putting heat back in it. I'm gonna leave the knobs though, just for looks. That's about it, guys. We'll uh, get that done, hopefully soon. Maybe make it to the June Bug Rally sometime in Texas. I know that's quite a drive from New York down all the way down there. Uh, but fingers crossed, hopefully we can make it. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoy the ride and follow along as I fix up Stella Blue. Thanks guys.